This tutorial is going to show you how to use Kaltura within our Blackboard environment. Kaltura is basically just a video hosting site for your original content. So unlike YouTube, you won't be able to find other content that exists outside on the web. This is a private um, video hosting tool that we have that's embedded with Blackboard for your own content. So only the people in your class will be able to see it and not people in the outside world. The first thing you need to do, obviously, is to have content. So Kaltura gives you the option to either upload a video file that you already have on your computer or create a screencast. So what we're going to do is add the gallery. So I'm going to go up to the plus sign here and I'm going to click on tool link. I'm going to name this Kaltura Gallery and I'm going to go to the drop down menu to Media Gallery and this will put Kaltura, all the Kaltura content you have in your course menu for your students to see. I'm going to make this available to users and click Submit. Now I can see it down here. When I click on the gallery, as you can see, I don't have any content in there yet. So I'm going to want to add some content. So I'm going to go up to here to the Add Media button. I'm going to upload media or record from webcam. This, this option I'm going to pick is upload media. I could also use the screen recorder, which is the exact same tool as Screencast-O-Matic, which is what I'm using to make this screencast. But for this choice, I'm going to pick upload media. Now you can browse through your files. So I'm going to browse through, pick that file, and then upload it. It's going to take a little bit to upload. Now I can see it's all done. I can click Next, I can give it a title, I can give it tags to make it more searchable, and add a description. I'm going to skip that for now and just click Next. Now it's processing. You can see this pop-up comes up that says the entry is converting. It's processing. Please try again in a few minutes. So we're just going to wait patiently for this to process. Once it's finished processing, you will see it here. You can play it to watch and make sure everything's the way you ex expect it to be. You're going to want to go down here and check off Make the Item Public in the Gallery and Add to Gallery Module on the course homepage. Now you're all set with that. The next option is to add it into your course in some content area. So I'm going to pick this content area here. And I'm going to add it here. Now I could also add it directly as its own content area. If I click Tools and click Kaltura Media, I'll be able to add it that way. Um, as a standalone item, it has a little less context, so I'm going to want to add it inside a content area that already exists. So I'm going to add it in here. And I'm going to add it as a mashup. So I'm going to pick my spot to add it. Hit the drop down arrow in Mashups and select Kaltura Media. And now I can find the one that I want. Select. I can pick my options. I'm going to click Submit. And now it'll show up. So when I click Submit, and then if I want to go back into Kaltura, take a look, I can see my video right here, and I can play it. And there it is.